Welcome back to TV5 News at 9. It's now time for Education Matters with Saginaw Intermediate School District. Joining us this morning, our great friend, Superintendent Dr. Jeffrey Collier. Dr. Collier, thanks for being here with us. It's such a pleasure to be with you today. Thank you very much. Yes, of course. So we are expanding our Education Matters segment to educators at Saginaw ISD. Tell us, what can people expect to see in the coming months? This is the first of its kind that we're aware of in the mid-Michigan area where we have been able to partner as a large school system, Saginaw Intermediate School District with WNEM TV5 mm -hmm. to be able to provide this community forum, if you will, for an opportunity to learn more and engage with our school systems, our very dynamic uh, community school systems mm -hmm. that will provide an opportunity for our listeners, our viewers, our constituents, if you will, mm -hmm. to better understand the greatest assets uh, that we have in our community and how we invest in those greatest assets, which are our children. Yeah, and the election has come and gone. What are some key legislative issues currently impacting public schools? Legislative issues come and go, they shift, they evolve uh, with current topics and with the times. So what we focus on are, we, we definitely advocate in the moment for different topics, but we work to build really strong relationships with our legislators that represent our communities mm -hmm. to be able to have a greater dialogue and a deeper understanding about the why and the purpose of what we need to do. Mm -hmm. Our legislators are fantastic representatives of us, mm -hmm. however, their, uh, their slates are very full. We mm -hmm. provide a, a very linear lens of educational topics and mm -hmm. expertise that we hope to educate them so that they can best represent us to be able to improve our school systems moving forward. Yeah, and one of the topics is talent together. Tell us yeah. a little bit more about that topic, what it means, and the importance of it. Well, talent together is uh, first of its kind, mm -hmm. very similar to this partnership, mm -hmm. really. It's a first of a kind uh, idea that was generated between 12 ISDs in the state of Michigan. Mm -hmm. Saginaw ISD was one of the 12 originators of this partnership. There are 83 counties in the state of Michigan, 56 intermediate school districts that service those 83 counties, and Saginaw ISD being one of the largest and most scaled helped originate Talent Together. Mm -hmm. Talent Together is a concept that is focusing on increasing the amount of teachers that we have, certified teachers in the state of Michigan. Mm -hmm. It's open to all Michiganders and it's free for anybody who wants to seek their certification to become a school teacher teacher. That could be somebody who uh, might not have finished their bachelor's degree, might be a paraeducator, uh, a paraprofessional, a support staff in schools, could be a substitute teacher. If they have the opportunity to enroll into Talent Together, we have the opportunity to help them facilitate the rest of their uh, education for free while earning a wage in the school system as a registered apprenticeship program and be able to become a, a Michigan certified teacher. That's awesome. It's fantastic. Yeah, and I bet it helps to bridge the gap that we're having right now in education with the teacher shortage, right? It's a, that's the intent. Yeah. There's, there's multitudes of intent in here, but yeah. part of the grounded purpose is not only to increase the amount of talent into yeah. our classrooms for our students, but an opportunity to not only retain the great professionals mm -hmm. that we currently have, all those people who are already providing the angelic support yeah. that are happening in our classrooms mm -hmm. to be able to allow them the opportunity to consider becoming certain certified teachers mm -hmm. and the opportunity to attract not only teachers who might have left the profession, mm -hmm. come back to the profession, or teachers from out of state to be able to come to, to Michigan. Yes, good stuff. So share with us how Saginaw ISD kind of works to support local school districts and how this segment and this partnership that you now have with TV5 will kind of help further those efforts. Well, it's a really a duality. We're looking to, with this segment, with Education Matters and this great partnership with WNEM TV5, we're looking to increase the opportunity for our communities to understand education and the dynamic aspect of what it is. Mm -hmm. Our school systems are incredibly positive and very vibrant, but they can be complicated as well. There's a lot of uh, legislative action, there's a lot of uh, rules that happen with school systems. Mm -hmm. And what Saginaw ISD does is we provide uh, quality customer service with the gold standard of service for our local school districts. Mm -hmm. We are servant leader providers along with educational experts. And we really do two things. We provide an opportunity to level the playing field for, or to better help level the playing field for all of our schools and students. Mm -hmm. We believe that all means all in a very transparent way. Mm -hmm. We also have the opportunity to help our local school districts navigate and adapt to change mm -hmm. that seems very continuous in today's world. Yeah. But when we 
we focus about education, it's important that people understand that we're focusing on the educational aspects of the students of today and tomorrow. Mm -hmm. And those changes are going to come with some strife, mm -hmm. they're going to come with some questions, and that's what we hope this segment will be able to do as we uh, continue to help partner with all of our local school districts. Yeah, and one of the takeaways that I love that you bring up is navigating change. Uh, <laughs> so what are some ways that Saginaw ISD is helping schools navigate shifts in education and how do you hope to address these shifts in some upcoming Education Matters segments? Well, some of the things that we'll be able to do is we're hoping to continue, I love that word navigation, yes. so I'm going to steal on that <laughs> word from you as well. We're going to work really hard to help navigate not only understanding of why we do things, mm -hmm. but an opportunity to be able to create transparent areas that are focused on equity mm -hmm. for everybody. When we think about what Saginaw Intermediate School District can do uh, in uh, an understanding of millages, for example, we help provide a special education millage countywide for all of our schools and all of our students regardless of zip code. Mm -hmm. We have an opportunity to provide uh, support with career technical education with our millage. We have an opportunity to be able to talk about matters that are coming up mm -hmm. that hopefully will be very diverse and divergent. Mm -hmm. Matters that include uh, infrastructure and technology, mm -hmm. school safety, mm -hmm. issues that talk about attraction retention for teachers and mm -hmm. human resource considerations, mm -hmm. business finance and budgeting for schools mm -hmm. and, and that hairy uh, mm -hmm. dilemma that comes up uh, every year. Uh, we'll have an opportunity to talk about special education and mental health mm -hmm. and wellness for our students and our staff and our community. We'll have an opportunity to be able to talk about early childhood and preschool options mm -hmm. and then we'll have an opportunity to be able to talk about instruction, curriculum, career technical education, mm -hmm. These are some of the pieces that we're hoping to be able to bring to our community to increase this dialogue and understanding of the greatest profession yeah. in human history, education. Yeah. And there are so many topics to cover. We're so excited about them. Which one are you most excited about? Probably all of them, right? <laughs> I, I am... I am an education junkie. Mm. I love talking about education, mm -hmm. and for me, my honey hole is about educational leadership. I love mm -hmm. talking about culture, climate, I love talking about the environment of education and all mm -hmm. things that are. So it's a very in engaging and very encompassing conversation yeah. that I'm really looking forward to having with our entire regional constituency. Yeah, we're going to learn to have some fun, <laughs> Dr. Can, Collier. I cannot wait. Yeah. All right, well, as always, it's great to get your expertise, and thank you for being here with us. Thank you so much. Yes, of course. And you can find more information on today's topic, Education Matters, in the hot link section of our website, WNEM.com. We'll be right back.